This is JSA TV, the newsroom for tech and telecom professionals. I'm Dean Perrine and welcome to JSA TV. We are coming at you on location from beautiful Miami, Florida at Metro Connect 2019. And I am here with my new best friend, Mr. Ben Edmond. Ben is the CEO and founder of Connected to Fiber. Ben, welcome to JSA TV. Well, thank you very much for having me. I appreciate the time, Dean. You bet, you bet. Now, so um, like a lot of folks here, you are in the business of solving problems. Um, yeah, yeah. So um, tell us, tell our viewers a little bit about some of the problems that Connected to Fiber solves. A absolutely. Well, we solve three primary problems in the industry. One centers around growth. How to grow effectively in a competitive large industry that connectivity is, you know, constantly trying to drive for the next evolution of growth is, is a challenge. Where to allocate sales and marketing resources, how to find and retain those next customers. And that's really what we built our organization around. We also solve for location. One of the key ingredients that we find in the growth formula is really understanding your total addressable market, how to get authority around it, share it with an ecosystem that is connectivity from the carriers to the channel partners to the cloud platforms and really drive that next step with location intelligence. And the last one that, that we solve for is how to price. You know, how do, how do you use pricing as a strategic lever inside of a business to elevate your growth strategy, increase your win rates and be more effective. Outstanding. So um, you're solving problems, but you're also um, in the business of um, seeing trends, we are. Um, realizing what those trends are and how to use those to better serve your customers. Things like SD-WAN, 5G, the edge. We're hearing a ton about the edge right now. Why don't you tell us a little bit about the trends that you folks are seeing and how you expect to, uh, to deploy some of those new technologies? Sure, absolutely. Uh, some of the trends that we see, you know, that you just mentioned, uh, this whole transition of the network to SD-WAN enabled ecosystem is a really important trend going on. Legacy MPLS networks are being replaced with this software defined ecosystem. And what that's doing is it's allowing the enterprise customers, the business customers that are making the spend decisions to select the best network from a last mile perspective and then enable these new next generation applications right over the network. And while it was theory a couple years ago, it's practice today. Right. And uh, along the same lines, we're seeing this really big push to the edge. You know, a lot of understanding that needs to go into making that a reality. But ultimately, what we're seeing is the mobile eyeballs and the cloud, eye, the cloud users want to come together with the cable go eyeballs. And that's all happening in this next generation architecture out at the last mile. Outstanding. So um, why don't you tell our viewers a little bit about your specific platform, the Connected to Fiber platform? So we've built what we call the connected world. It is a uh, uh, industry cloud application built for the connectivity world. Very location centric platform that's aligned to our core goals of helping our customers grow, helping them use intelligence in a big data way to make decisions around where to target, who the best partners are, how to execute that next build or process, mm -hmm. um, and really drive that go to market process within the connectivity industry. Um, so customers, um, I know I, good. I, I, <laughs> I know that you like them. We do. Um, why don't you talk a little bit about your customers? Who who are they? Sure. So we have a uh, a pretty wide range of customers that uh, are all representative. I care about the connectivity industry. So mm -hmm. think about the uh, MSOs, you know, which are represented here at sure. the uh, the uh, the conference. You know, we have eight out of the top ten as customers. Um, over 45 Lex as customers, the competitive fiber industry building out this next generation uh, fiber ecosystem. We've done very well in this space. Um, and then people that care about connectivity, cloud and application providers that are reliant on this, data center operators that you know their ecosystems are dependent, you know have come into our platform to, to get value. Very good, very good. And um, just real quick, I'm going off script really quick. Is that okay? Um, Why not? I, the show has only just started. Why don't you tell our viewers a little bit about how the show is going for you? That's fantastic. It's one of our favorite conferences of the year. Um, it's been a great uh, to sit down, to, to learn. I was on a panel yesterday with Microsoft and Hunter and V Exchange and great dialogue and suspects. discussion. Yeah, yeah, it's good, important. Good, yeah. 
but the, you know how people communicate, increase transparency, and really use data and automation to take the industry to the next step. And we're right in the middle of that conversation. I love it. Um, how can our viewers learn a little bit more about Connected to Fiber? Well, please come to our website, uh, www.connected2fiber.com. Um, we'd love to have uh, demos, discussions. Feel free to reach out, and uh, we look forward to the next conversation. Very cool, Ben. Thank you for, for being with us today. We appreciate it. You bet it. And thank you, viewers, for watching JSA TV. We'll see you soon.